Hi everybody, I'm Coach Ali and this is Coach Steph Davis. Welcome to Reignite, the follow-up series to our iconic Ignite Summer Body Transformation Dumbbell Workout Program. Ignite series will help you get your summer body transformation more effectively than any other workout series online by training you according to science around your body's energy expenditure system. We start every workout with strength training to efficiently rid your body of glucose so that later through the workout we can dig into your fat storage and use it as a source of energy to complete your mild cardio component. Each superset in Reignite is made up of two related exercises covered in 30 second intervals. Then we follow it with 30 seconds of rest. As you already know, you can't burn body fat without depleting your body of glycogen first. So let's have you work out the correct way as though you've hired your very own aesthetics personal trainer. The first five workouts in our Reignite series is available to everybody with access to YouTube, X or Rumble and all five workouts are free of charge. The next 15 workouts are available exclusively to our YouTube channel members. Channel membership can be obtained for a tiny fee of $3 per month and you can do this by hitting the join icon when you're on our YouTube channel. Channel members have access to all of our premium content, including full series access to Ignite, Gains and Ripped, just to name a few. That's enough talking from us, let's get started with today's Reignite Summer Body Transformation Dumbbell Workout. We'll see you on the other side. Alternate narrow chest presses for this exercise. Now, we're doing this exercise on a mild incline. However, if you have a flat bench with you, then you can do this exercise flat as well. Our hands are remaining neutral and you can see that the dumbbells are meeting at the top together. And make sure that you're offering nothing but vertical movement of the arms. We're looking for ample control both on the way up and the way down as well. Your second exercise is some lying triceps tape presses. Drop one head of your dumbbells onto your chest while widening your elbows. Once you've touched your chest, work your way in reverse until you've got parallel arms at the top of the exercise.
Don't forsake this life of yours. I'll guide you home no matter where you are. One day my father told me, son, don't let it slip away. When I was just a kid, I heard him say, when you get old. This exercise is a wide flat chest press. You can see we're using a flat bench and we're making sure our lower back is pinned against it. Our elbows are dropping beside us nice and wide and then we're pushing up until we've got the dumbbells together with soft straight elbows. The pace of the movement on the way up and on the way down should be identical. Exhaling as you push those dumbbells together. We'll get into a seated position for the second exercise and you can see we're doing our skull crushes with our back nice and straight and our chest proud and we're looking at minimizing any movement in our elbow, making sure that the arms are staying tucked in by our ears and that they're not hanging out.
We're starting the superset with a flat rotating chest press. So you can see 180 degrees rotation from where the dumbbell starts at the top until you've turned it and lowered it onto your chest. Keep your elbows tucked in the whole time. Make sure your dumbbells are meeting at the top in order to find a stable point. And like all of your flat exercises, make sure your lower back is pinned against your bench in order to protect it. Your second exercise is to lean forward, hinging at the hips and working some triceps backswings. So the rotation is purely at the shoulders and our arms are moving from their vertical position to a horizontal position behind us.
starting the superset with some dumbbell reverse pullovers. We're doing this on an incline. However, if you only have a flat bench at your disposal, you could do it flat as well. Make sure your lower back is pinned against your bench and your feet should be wide enough to keep you nice and stable. Your arms start parallel in that horizontal position. And as you lift the dumbbell, turn and face your palms towards yourself. Your second exercise is some dumbbell crucifix flies. So rather than doing the flies traditionally with your hands in a neutral position, we've got it facing away 90 degrees so that the dumbbell heads are meeting each other. I was good to pay that girl like Uncle Sam. Back it on me, shot a craving on me, get to eating on me. She waited on me, shot a kicking on me, got the bacon on me. This is sister in the bacon on me. Point blank close range, that be. If they kiss a million, that's me. I was getting moola, baby. Havana, unana. Half of my heart is in Havana, unana. He took me back to East Atlanta, na na na. Toes in the sand, used to season my sweater, was having a adventure, head in the clouds, but my gravity center, touch my neck, and I'll touch yours, you and those little hot waisted shorts. 
This is a body weight combination. We're starting with some bench push-ups. We're going nice and wide with our hands for this one. So it's a great opportunity to work your chest in particular and making sure that your push-ups are nice and deep with your tailbone tucked in. Don't allow your hips to dip because we want to engage our core and make sure there's minimal pressure on our back. For your second exercise, we're gonna work some bench triceps dips. Place your hands beside you and make sure your arms remain nice and parallel with each other. When you drop into your dip, keep your butt close to your bench. Don't move too far forward away from it because you'll put too much pressure on your rotator cuffs. Cause it's too cold for you here And now, so let me hold Both your hands in the holes of my sweater If I may, just take your breath away I don't mind if there's not much to say Sometimes the silence guides the mind To move to a place so far away Cause from start the race The minute that my left hand meets your waist and then I watch your face, put my finger on your tongue, cause you love the taste, yeah. And these hearts adore, everyone ever beats hard as for. Inside this place is warm, outside it starts to pour. Coming down, one love, two miles, one love, one house. No sharp, no blouse, just us to find out. Nothing that I wouldn't want to tell you about. No, 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 cause it's too cold.
Let's start this set with a left supported skull crusher. We're using our right hand to keep our left elbow in check. So just grab hold of the bicep nice and tight and make sure that the upper part of the active arm remains vertical the whole time. Then we're simply looking for 90 degrees elbow flexion, squeezing with your triceps to return the dumbbell into its vertical position. For the second exercise, we're simply going to switch hands. So let's look for the same level of support. Keep that elbow in position, make sure it doesn't move. Work through your 90 degrees range of motion and make sure that your lower back is pinned against your bench. Well done everybody for making it to the fat burning component of this workout. 
Now that you've effectively lowered your blood glucose, we can start burning body fat by keeping your heart rate in your fat burning zone. Let's take a moment to rehydrate with a sip of water while Coach Ali explains training in your fat burning zone. Now, even if you're already familiar with the fat burning zone formula, don't skip this section. Take this opportunity to simply rest your body and prepare for our conditioning component. Your maximum natural heart rate is regarded as 220 minus your age. So let's quickly calculate this number. For example, I'm 46 years old, so my theoretical maximum heart rate is 174 beats per minute. Now, multiply your maximum heart rate by 0.67. We want to be two thirds of the way up there so that we're in our optimal fat burning zone. My optimal fat burning heart rate is 117 beats per minute, which is achieved through low intensity cardio after your weights training. Now calculate your optimal fat burning heart rate. Let's get active and let's burn some body fat. Starting this superset with some Russian squats. So it's a regular air squat and it's got a twist and we're throwing those twists in alternately between those squats. For your second exercise, we're working some cardio uppercuts. Stay light on your toes, make sure you pivot with your hips and just throw those uppercuts nice and lightly and have some fun with it.
wanna stay, wanna stay, wanna stay now. You can see it in my eyes that I wanna take you down right now if I could. So I hope you know what I mean when I say, let me take you dancing. For the first exercise, we are doing some two-hand floor touches. So squat with your feet parallel, nice and wide. Try and get as deep as you can and try to palm the floor. For the second exercise, we're working some alternate knee strikes. Work on a good hip thrust and try to open your hips up, throwing those knees as high as they'll go. Don't know what you're expecting of me But under the pressure I'm walking in your shoes Caught in the undertow Just caught in the undertow And every step that I take Is another mistake to you
Starting this superset with a butt kicker. You can see I'm using a jogging motion, but if you have trouble with the impact on your knees, then do it the way Steph's doing and just step into it. For your second exercise, we're gonna march on the spot. Make sure you raise your knees nice and high and landing onto the floor nice and gently. Passing by, but I still can't seem to tell you why It hurts me every time I see you Realize how much I need you I hate you, I love you I hate that I love you Don't want to, but I can't fight Nobody else above you I hate you, I love you I hate that I want you You want her, you need her And I will never be her I want you When I can eat, I miss you in my front seat Still got ten in my sweaters from night we don't remember Do you miss me like I miss you? Messed around and got attached to you Friends can break your heart too And I'm always tired but never of you If I pull you on you, you wouldn't like that shit I put this real out, but you wouldn't like that shit I type a text but then I never mind that shit I got these feelings but you never mind that shit Oh, oh, keep it on the low You're still in love with me but your friends don't know If you wanted me, you would just say so And if I were you, I would never let me go I hate you, I love you I hate that I love you Don't want to but I can't but Nobody else above you I hate you, I love you I hate that I want you You want her, you need her And I will never be her I want you Well done everybody, you got through today's dumbbell workout for a summer body. Now what did you like or even dislike about today's workout? Comment and let us know because we can then better understand what you think about our workout and our training methods. We'd like to thank you for training with us today and we look forward to you training with us in our next workout together. Before we go, can we please ask that you hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss future workouts in this series.
If you think your friends or family could benefit from today's workout, then please share a link with them and let's help your loved ones get fit and healthy too. Once again, thank you for tuning in and we look forward to seeing more of you right here shortly.